This movie actually got second place on the poll that I put on YouTube, but I'm still gonna react to it because I know it's been highly requested and I'm gonna give it a chance. I read the description of this movie and it seems that it's pretty predictable. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what the description said because I kind of predicted what's gonna happen in the movie, but it's probably not gonna be what I think it is. We're just gonna have to watch and see what this movie is really gonna be like. What's good, Spidey gang? MJ here and today we're gonna be watching Belly. This movie is starring DMX, which believe it or not, I'm actually a DMX wow. fan. What they really want, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, anyways. I am actually a DMX fan and when I heard this movie was starring DMX, I was really, yes, really, sir. really excited yes, to see it. I don't know anybody else in the movie. It says Method Man is in this movie too. So I know Method Man and that's it. That's all I know. But anyways, I, like I said in the intro, I did see the description for this movie and I have a prediction for it, but I'm not gonna say what the prediction is until the end of the movie and I'll tell y'all if my prediction is right or wrong okay okay but anyways if you guys do end up enjoying my reaction to this movie do not forget to like and subscribe to your girl I do movies like this all the time I do different kinds of movies I do shows I do anime I do you know what I'm saying so subscribe to your girl anyway if you want to see my full reaction to this movie and every other movie and show on my channel go ahead and click that patreon link down in the description below full movie and show reactions are there and I take requests in there as well i don't want to say this every video oh, but i'm going shit. to say it every video for the sake of my newcomers i only take real requests and movies only requested on patreon get added to the list unfortunately if you give it anywhere else it will literally only be a suggestion and i will take it with a grain of salt i probably won't even watch it <laughs> unless I'm interested in it really. But again, I only take real requests added to my list from Patreon. Hey yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the movie. <laughs> But yeah, like I was saying, I have a prediction for this movie, you know what I'm saying? But I think I'm just gonna enjoy the movie. I don't think I'm gonna yap too much at it, you know what I'm saying? Yo, it was cold on this level. It's twice as deep. What the heck? They're over here doing a seance? Step on toe, strong arm, and show a little muscle. Ain't no real though. I really, 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 really hope they use DMX music in this movie, because that would be so fire. Hey, a Big Dog Films production too. We ain't gotta worry about nothing. <laughs> oh, you ready? What's going on? What's going on? Bro, I just thought DMX was so fine. <laughs> I don't want to sound like a girl right now, but I always thought DMX was so fine. I'm down, take a look around. What the heck, man? What? This dude's a demon. Oh, oh my god, the titties. We're in a strip club. <laughs> oh my god. Nobody, Nas is in this too. Hey, 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 no touching. What is wrong with these dudes' eyes? Oh my god, the flashing. My eyeballs, Jesus Christ. Jesus, the flashing. What the heck, man? They're trying to blind me. Ah, the old toilet behind the, I mean, going behind the toilet trick. Something's gonna happen here, huh? Yeah, I knew it. Hey, man. <laughs> that, that money. Money make you do crazy things. Me and Bundy, we like make it happen. Like Butch and Sundance doing anything to get the dub. Bundy? That's a crazy name, bro. I knew he was a problem as soon as knowledge put him down what the heck Dump it, man. i wish the scene was more clear like i'm happy he's introducing us but i can't really put faces to the names a fat new crib like his shit wild panini in there raw kid this crib look nice is this his real crib he my ass. Hey, yo kids this small should not be talking like that y'all damn You know what? I'm be honest with you. I don't think I'd be able to live in a in a really white house. This shitty ass rabbit stink. Oh. Like what? what the heck, man? Now Keisha, Keisha was a bad mother. Yeah, I know that that a whole white house is crazy. What is going 
going on and why y'all making so much noise? Sorry, Chief, baby, that's my fault. I am trying to sleep. God. Girl, what an attitude. I'm about to go get some sleep, my damn self. All right. See y'all niggas the most. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, so Bonds is a little mm, attitude having ass dude. That's what it's looking like. You don't tolerate nothing. Y'all ever met those people? I know I have, but met those people that like, like you get on, like you just hit that one nerve and they, it's like they flip a whole script. Like it's like, oh, you disrespecting me? Like they don't take no ounce of disrespect whatsoever. You ever met those people? They scary. Those people are scary. And who is this? Why the f are you paging my man? Who? Tommy. You know who I'm talking about. Wow, now it's, now it's paging. It's reported that this heroin is dramatically more potent than previous forms of the drug. He don't even, he over here thinking about the heroin. He don't even care that his girl up here talking to someone. That's crazy. By a various conduits in Jamaica and throughout the West Indies. Well, more on the story as it breaks. That girl does not act like someone who would be like being with her man or nothing though. So I feel like it's something else. Are you f***ing Tommy or what? I'm only 16. I did suck his the night before last. Why are you like, why are you entertaining this, man? If a woman called me and talk, talking about, are you fucking hanging up or whatever? You getting hung up on, like, you getting hung up on for real. Because that's not my problem. Go talk to your man. Sorry things ain't working out for you too. I'm gonna see your little ass around. See, I never understood why women do this. Be mad at him. Why you mad at her? Like, nigga, I told you stop with me. So who's narrating this though? I can't, who is that? That's uh, sincere, right? That's who narrating it. Thing, you know how that go. I mean, seriously, why can't we just start a business or something? I'm about to say, nah, you got a baby. It's not do your thing no more. Like, you got to take care of your family. What you think I'm going to be doing out here? Nothing? Just sitting around starving? You act like we're broke. I mean, what the f And you got a pretty woman. That she sucked your little black ding last night. So what you got to say now, huh? Fuck you, all right? You. I hate women who go through phones or in this case pagers like you if you going through it and you already thinking about it Then you should just leave bro. Why would you sit here and make you piss yourself off? You know what I'm saying? Listen, take. Listen. Listen. Mm -mm. If there's one thing I hate it's uh, it's when a man uses his strength against you. I really hate that. Hey, yo, Jesus Christ <laughs> the aggression. Let me stop. Jeez. Damn. So you know he cheating on you and you still let him lay you down in the bed and leave you there. Some women have no morals. None. Zero. Like I said, if you have the feeling that they're cheating on you, just leave. Don't even sit here and piss yourself off or entertain it, bro. And he, see, and this one actually has a family. You shouldn't be acting like this. We should be the next niggas with that. Oh, the dope game. Now you want the dope. That's where the money's at, baby. I hate men with that mentality too. Oh my God, I hate people with that mentality, bro. There is money in everything. Like, it's not just money in that. Ain't no money like dope money. Son, you sound stupid right now. You not even hearing me right now, man. He hearing you, he's just telling you you stupid. Like, hello? Are we on the same page? <laughs> you sound like wifey talking. You might as well pack it up. Stay home, man. Bitch, you'll f your whole shit up. No, nah, I'll be like, don't call my wife a bitch. <laughs> we gonna have some problems, you know what I'm saying? He must be scared to bro or something, cause I really, you know what I'm saying? I love the slow motion they do between scenes. It's funny. They was too young for now, but buns keep these little niggas around all the time, man. They was young thugs in training and shit. Uh, not in training. <laughs> Don't train the children. See, you should always want the children to be better. That's the thing. He was one of those PhD niggas though. A player hating kid. You know how to fuck with him, right? Player hating kid. That's what they just call the PhD. This is so sad, bro. Like, this is just real sad. Bro, niggas be wildin' this shit. I'm gonna say fuck that shit and get money with y'all niggas. No. Finish school. Be patient. You shouldn't say just be patient till they ask to finish school. Knowledge. He was a for real grimy nigga. He the type of nigga that's just too smart for his own good. His name is Knowledge. How ironic is that? I heard that motherfucker was out there running his motherfucking mouth and shit. Matter of fact, I heard the nigga was trying to act like he wanted the sticks and shit. Oh, the instigating is crazy. Dude, every time you turn around, this nigga got a bottle to his mouth like a baby bottle. Hey, yo, man. Really, bro? Yeah, no, I don't like the way you acting, bro. You disrespecting people now. <laughs> oh, now shoot him, mother... Did they shoot him? I didn't shoot him. I thought I heard a gunshot go off. Think it's a joke, nigga! 
fuck is wrong with you, man? Oh, we making him get naked. Over there while we count this money. Wow. Count that money, man. Count that fucking money. <laughs> Bro, I seen a video, like, I don't know if y'all seen the video that had went viral or whatever. Bro was with his ops or whatever, and they made him, like, get booty naked and twerk on top of a chair. I feel like making them get naked is a different kind of disrespect. Like, I think I would never be able to show my face again. i probably end my life. Like, that is just, that's so harsh. Like, I get the embarrassment is the point, but, like, wow. <laughs> they was really making bro, he was, like, on the chair, like, ah, oh, damn. <laughs> For some reason, every time I hear a trumpet, I, I think of Spanish music. Right. What the heck is happening? Who are these people, man? Why we keep we keep getting see this is this is my problem with some movies, bro. We keep getting thrown at so many new characters. It's hard to grasp their stories, you know. The wildest niggas out here. He's my only connection to getting this new shit. Why is DMX dressed like that? He look whack. Yeah, he look in Jaro Palette could be. Watch this sock again, you know, Jamaica. You threw the Billy to be. I love that accent. Oh my god, I love that accent. That new shit they talk about on TV, brown shit. What the heck? Did he just put the volume up? Sir, how disrespectful. Yeah, yeah, draw. Dead ass, man. Can't deal with that. Oh, okay, he put it louder so they can't hear the conversation. So, I don't want to ask, I don't want to fuck with you because you are the face good I watch, all right? Blood clot, no. I can understand some of the stuff he's saying, but everything else is confusing me. I have to focus way too hard to understand what he's saying. Ross clot, Jamaican, in the United States of America, and I make lots of money and deal with the business. Don't bring that shit to me. I understood that. Mm hmm. Snap on him. Boy, who you thought you is? Get on, man. I'm hungry. I need this shit. You know how I get down, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can't look at his face. I have like, I have this issue with pimples and stuff. <laughs> I'm an addict. It's just helping nigga out, man. That's all I'm trying to do. Man, by your woman, I'm big. Anything, I'm Big pussy Anything. Cloud, ever. He is speaking so calm. And this dude, you can tell he's like jittery and, and wants all the action. Man. Yo, I'm saying. Yo, I'm trying to live. I'm trying to quiet. Mm -mm, you know dang well she could hear her. All right. Bye. One. Dude, did you hang up the phone? Wow, uh, the disrespect. People who like that who are reckless and 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 disrespectful and just all over the place never end up good in life. Never, never. Like it don't matter what you're doing. That's crazy. Disrespecting the girl that's really down for you, really loves you. It looks like they're going down two different paths here. I see. Yeah, they're going down two different paths. Oh, that was the other guy. I thought that was bro with the baby. I was like, who is this on his lap? But no, that's the other guy. <laughs> this girl is a cop, like a real cop. We set up shop in no time. Knowledge had the whole area clicking. Y'all are ruining this dang neighborhood. Them white girls look healthy, happy, and frivolous. And you gave them drugs, and now they finna be crackheads. Knowledge will make it do head by head. We money. <laughs> Here we go again. Nah, for real, man. Y'all never think about that shit like, <laughs> like what we here. Bro, you just don't want to do that no more, man. You always act like it got to be something else to this shit. You know what I'm saying? I learned recently, there's a, I forgot what it's called. I think it's nihilism, optimistic nihilism. I think that's what it's called. But you have to like become accustomed to the, the, the fact that there is no purpose in life. Like you're just living to be here. Like <laughs> there's nothing you can do. Reading this new book, man. This shit is so deep, yo. Shit got my mind thinking about. Talking about reading this new book. Sir, the Bible. The Bible is the new book you read in. Think another motherfucker know what you need to do? Ain't no purpose, dog. Born to fucking die, man. Get money. See, that's, that's exactly what I was saying. But except it's more optimistic. But you have to just think that there is no reason to live. Like since we got this. Ooh. This man is wearing bifocals and wearing a wig. Yeah, they they rolling hard too. They they slang it real good, real good. This man is eating a banana with bifocals and a wig. What the heck? No one is scared of this. Might have to drop a dime on them. Sure. You know what I'm saying? 
every guy I have seen, every man I have seen eat a banana, they do not bite it straight down. Like they refuse to do it. So I'm just like, you gonna eat the banana like that? Like me personally. Cause shorty can't eat no books, dog. My shorty's all right, man. Man. Stop worrying about my girl. You worry about chores, the one you cheating on. Who don't even who sit here saying she loves you. She looks stupid next to your ass. My hair smoking weed, speeding, all that, dog. That, that's me, untouchable. Now when them cops pull you over, then what? You so goofy. Like he really thinks he's untouchable for real. Like again, dudes like that who think they're immortal and won't take no shit from no one really be crashing hard. Like for real. You remember when I told you you owe me one? This is it, the big vacation. It is what you want. Hmm. I don't know, man. That's a little fishy. That's a little fishy. Eat me. They mean to tell me that some of them get confused. What? They going to Jamaica. Love it. I want to go out the country so bad. I don't know about Jamaica, but I want to go anywhere else at this point. Like, just take me somewhere. <laughs> Someone just take me. This is the ghetto. I keep it strong, see Treat yourself a real shop. Dude, this is where you're from. But you become so accustomed to the, the castle that you live in. You think all this is, is raggedy and stuff. Like, man live like a king in America. This is where I man come from. You know, show me a deal with. What the heck? Why he got a gun? Out of a place called Jamaica Games. Make the games? I mean, I'll make a fuck up. Jamaican. Oh my god, this whole scene is making my brain hurt because I have to focus so hard. Them pussy front tire. Uh. Make your dick get hard like rock wilder. It also does not help that he has grills in his mouth, like. Yo, Tia, where you at? What the heck? Where'd his girl go? Oh, there she go. Oh, she went out with the girl. Okay. You know, I can't seem to get this nigga away from me. And I know he's the worst type of nigga to have, but yet I keep hoping that maybe one day... Ma'am, toxic relationship? I hate to say it, but you're right, you know. It just hurts to be alone. Girl, that hair is crazy. Like, she, she, they're both so pretty, but this girl with the blonde hair, her hair is crazy. I'm happy with Cecilia because I'm happy. If I wasn't happy with him, then I have to do what I have to do. You get what I'm saying? You, you have to be happy either way, man. It can't just be because you happy with him. Be all right. You just gonna have to, you know, take it one day at a time. That's all I can think. At least she was nice enough to come with her. Taking care of a little business. That's all. I missed you. I missed you too. I'm so happy that he's really trying to wrap it up and, and be there for his family. Aww. He's really just trying to clean himself up so he could be there for his family. I love that. Sincere is being sincere. <laughs> he's he's truly being amazing. But what's bro's name? Buns? He's just train wreck waiting to happen. I get that they've been friends for a really, really long time. But bro, it's, it's just not good for you. It's time to cut him off. <laughs> I never heard Jamaican music. Like, there's Jamaican artists or whatever, but they don't really sound. I don't know how to explain it. They don't sound real, I guess you could say. It's not like they're too forced. Hearing real Jamaican music definitely shows the, the culture. Every culture is different, and I love that. Where is she? That mohawk is crazy. His mohawk look like paper. <laughs> well, look at the way that dude's moving his hips. Jamaicans know how to dance too. I don't know about the males, but from the, the females, look like they never really know how to dance. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. See how big he is. Just cold, man. Everything all right. We are I saw one of my comments say chesticles and it brought me like way back to middle school because that's low-key what I used to say in middle school. I used to say chesticles for no reason. <laughs> it was just better than saying, you know, tits or something. Slinging rocks over here, you know what I'm saying? Majorly. Uh, who snitched? <laughs> Damn. You missed, bro? You're trash. And it's money. Damn, but he shot though. What are you gonna do? This man is shot. You gonna have to go to the hospital or something. <laughs> who snitched? I'm finna be mad, cause who snitched? They probably got your phone shot, but know where the <laughs> you at, you stupid. Who the f you calling a bench? You the bench once Tommy finds out about this. Oh, ma'am. Okay. She had every right to say that and hang up on him, but he's stupid for saying everything else. You know what I'm saying? Man, don't give him a dollar. He 
He was smart, acting like a bum. He he, he played. He looked like a bum too. Definitely played the part. <laughs> Is that his mohawk? I know his mohawk looked like paper. I wasn't tripping. It was like feathers or something. Not real. Yo, they killing us, son. I'm telling you. That niggas, come on. That's my word. That Is she gonna leave him? I'm so tired of the stereotypical woman who stayed with the toxic guy. Like, can we just not? Come on, you don't gotta touch it like that. She clearly don't got no weapons. Don't touch it like that. Look at this. Look at this lady cop looking lost as hell. Y'all suck at acting. I'm behind over here walking in circles. He gonna leave his girl there, huh? You mother trucker. He finna be like, nah, can't get caught by the cops. And then he finna run. Wow. 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 And on top of it, I think he's camped out around the corner somewhere. I'm getting scared. What the f is going on? I don't know. She look cute as hell, I'm not gonna lie, but you better stop, st yeah, stop playing with her. She could tell something's going on, bro. Just tell the truth. You get ready to come by, all right? Don't worry, I'm not going nowhere. I just wanna see what's going on. Whatever. See, see, you risking losing your woman just cause you don't wanna break ties with this toxic man. Come on, man. You sure it's the feds? Dog, you think I don't know the feds when I see him? Paranoid, man. Yeah, you are tripping, like, chill out a little bit. Pay phone, I can't use no regular phone let's go to linden real quick let's do it you just say you're not going nowhere you just lied to your woman i'm tired of these men bro i'm i'm sick of this shit bro for real bro i'm sick Jeez, again, man. Gotta call him, huh? man she probably not the one paging you it's probably the cops using her pager just to try to get your attention she says she's sick she don't even talk like that man take what we got all the time it's your nephew crib in jersey all right no don't get tied up into this you was just getting your life together no no man oh you're the only one i got in my corner man don't cross him got you one. that sound effect right there just say he was finna cross him or he was the one that crossed him hmm is that the guy that was shot See, this is the problem. They showed the character so fast that I, I couldn't connect with, with their stories and who they were, like. Knowledge bone. What's the science, baby? No, baby, shit is wicked out here. Oh, that's knowledge? Okay. Knowledge is in jail. That's crazy. I did not know that. What? Bitch, don't let me get no. I will. Hey, let me hold you. Hold on. Oh, my God. Not the bifocals guy. Flossing major chips, Rolex, everything. Tarted, if you ask me. Niggas got him outside right now. Nigga out front? Right out front. Bro, I'm so, <laughs> I'm so tired of looking at this guy, bro. He is not intimidating at all. Easy, cowboy. I just came to see if we can do something. Nigga, we don't f with out of town, especially silly mother like you. Bro, he is not intimidating at all. Like, who is he talking to? Let's meet at the gill. Mm. Now drink, so we can talk about it. We got to talk about when we get there. Mm. Do yeah, it like, like, like that, baby. That's right. how niggas. I'm glad he at least listened to him a little bit. That's all y'all niggas be saying. Face, face, <laughs> Now he got her locked up. Oh my God, he's so disgusting. He's so disrespectful. Like, look what he got you into. Like, see, now that now you're gonna listen to what that girl said and and leave this man. And she just met her the other day. She said, I know we don't know each other. Y'all remember that? Now she over here picking her up from jail. Look at that. Robbing niggas, drugs, whatever to get the dough. Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, uh, nah. I ain't from ATL. I refuse to say that. You can make shit happen anywhere. Get it. Learn how to put the mother weed in the bags first. Then, then get money. Did he take these kids with him? Out here. That niggas got to be willing to get down. Nah, not them kids. What you trying to get it? Gonna bust your gun to get it? Whatever, yo. They're saying, see, they're saying whatever, yo, but that first person they shoot finna traumatize them for the rest of their life. Well, where the phone at? It's upstairs. Yeah, no, this kid is stupid, though. <laughs> at least the other one is, is kind of somewhat sensible. This one just acted, it's upstairs, duh. Well, why you ain't tell me? Like, the hell? Y'all niggas don't get that bail money? You gonna see what time is. Nigga, suck my d you better stop playing with him. That man got deep connections. He finna <laughs> yo uh and then again you just pick up and left your girl, forgot all about her, like just for money. That's all you thinking about right now. And apparently they're supposed to bail that knowledge guy out. I guess that was the whole point of him helping him out or something. Oh my god, more strip clubs. I'm so tired of seeing strip clothes after the players club. Like, I am so sick of it. Woo! Ah, that shit. 
spot this thing up. Mm. So what was the real reason for you wanting to talk to bro? Cause I'm a little lost. <gasps> Not you just drug my drink. I'll take that in Wow. I like your play with Nate with the rail, son. You got it locked in here. This is live. Why did he drunk his drink? Okay, I'm so confused. I thought this guy was on a whole different mission. Like, who is this bifocal dude? Oh my god, it's not connecting with me right now, y'all. Yeah, what's that? God damn. Okay, so I guess he knew that knowledge was his enemy or whatever. Bro, shotgun to the chest and you running like that? That's crazy. Now it's kind of all connecting back to knowledge, wherever this knowledge person is. Hey, that, that's real catchy. Yeah, whoever this knowledge guy is, it's kind of all connecting right back to him, whoever they is. I don't know. It seemed time to flip shit to a new f***ing page. Yo, yo. He finally seeing the good in life, man. I love that. I love that. Open your hearts to God. You will see. Niggas, as soon as they said something, what you talking about? You was right there and then say shit. Right, like, what the hell are you talking about? Cassidy pushed your wig back, nigga. Like, don't even try to front. Yo, I seen how shit. It's too much tension at this table right now. He was ready to cry like a bitch. Nigga, I ain't see that though. And them niggas pulled out. Uh -huh. so, like, this is turning into a competition to see who's better to Tommy. And that's, it's not good because obviously they're kids and then their head, they're thinking this shit's cool and shit. I'm talking about, nigga. What? <laughs> not they scattering out. Bro, why you instigating? around to make a mistake. Ain't no mistakes, man. This motherfucker just talk too much. I had to shut him the fuck up. Okay. I was about to say, this dude is, uh, he's he's too cocky. He's turning into Tommy 2.0. This guy was just joking around and shit. Trying to, like he said, trying to get him to shut up. But that other dude crossed the line. And it was his fault that Wise got hit. He could have easily deaded the whole argument. But Buns, he's an instigator for real. Right, that's what I said. Tommy was at the end of his rope. Oh. Yep, and now they caught your ass. They were looking for you all this time. Now you got caught. Oh, you're thinking, I'm immortal. Yada, yada. Yeah, look at you now, bitch. Untouchable my ass. Them cuffs, girl, touching you. Them cuffs all over your hands. <laughs> Ain't no way he just gave Sincere's name. Ain't no way he just did that. Close door. He gave Sincere's name? Please, no, don't tell me. I got arrested on some bullshit last night, and I gotta get the f out of here before my prince come back. Tell me before my prince come back. Are you slow? No doubt, baby, I got you. Don't even worry about it. Peace. One. Mm-mm, you know they was listening to that conversation, talking about before my prince come back. You caught up anyways. I don't want to watch you on bum cloud no more. I don't even know what that means, but I used to say that a lot. Like, I don't remember if it was in middle school or high school. Someone taught me the word, and I was saying bum cloud every five seconds, and I don't even know what it means. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> this is looking like Scarface 2.0. Yeah, this is looking like Scarface 2.0, except he's drunk instead of I am okay. He's like, nah, I'm untouchable. Look at his face. You know what? There was between him and Scarface, and Scarface didn't see it coming. Bro, they can't even see. Like, what is the point of the wires? You can't see anything. Who wants to test me? Come on! How is he even shooting them in the dark? Like, what is happening? I murder people for fun. This guy is hilarious. The fact he's killing all of them, like, literally just by being here is crazy. Look at that. All he did was go to the ground and he killed him. Oh, no, you're not going to live this, though, buddy. He's 
laying in the same spot and y'all can't shoot him? That is ridiculous. That girl is gonna assassinate him in the most silent, gruesome way ever. Oh, she's brutal. Oh, she is sick. Uh, who is she? I need her. I need it. I need it. She's so bad. That is like the worst way to die. You sat here, killed all these people, was straight up invincible, and then she hopped on the head and what? You know what I'm saying? Shorty was like 12 going on 20. A real loser type nigga. No hope for the future at all. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a lot of them, because we know. Hmm. Niggas up mad early getting that paper, huh? Y'all got bags, you son. That is a child. Shot this nigga, man. I got still burning, man. Shit's just getting hot. That is a child! Oh my god! It's a war out here. Mad niggas is dying. You don't want that shit to be you, right? I know you're gonna hold it down, though. You know what I mean? I'm sorry. I can't watch this scene because I can't let go of the fact that this is a literal child. Like, this is a kid. Like, ain't even hit puberty yet. Make sure you rise above all this madness out here. Mind elevation, man. That petty shit. You don't need it. I see what he was trying to do, though. He was trying to teach him a lesson without genuinely teaching him a lesson. Because y'all got to understand what these people, or not these people, but just the people who like to hang in those crowds. Unfortunately, no matter what you tell them, if they don't figure it out for themselves, they're never going to get out of it. You know, if they don't learn themselves, they're always going to be in that crowd. You can sit here and please do it better for your family, for your, your, friend, your friends, your mom, your dad, whatever. It don't matter to them. It don't matter. Like, they have to do it themselves. They have to sit here, have a wake-up moment, or have a realization, and like, damn, I don't want to live like this. Police finally had you in custody. Wanted to come down and just uh, meet you in person. Pay attention and listen to me. What? They caught up with your ass? That's crazy. World's Day of Reckoning, the armory in Harlem. We will terminate this. We'll do everything in our power to help you. We'll give hmm? Why does he want him to kill a minister? It'll be your resignation. You understand? Yeah, I understand. All bro gotta do is be free. All he gotta do is kill someone, he can be free. I don't know if that's a dirty cop, but if it is, I am so tired of seeing these. Why can't we just be genuine? We need to start thinking about us. Because it's just too dangerous now. Come on now, listen to your girl. You got a baby, you got a family, like... Let's go to Africa. Please, be for real. Yo, I've never been more serious in my life. Africa's crazy, though. To go to our homeland, where our roots are. Fuck it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, forget about money. Everything. Oh, but okay. I wouldn't want to just randomly move to Africa, but the intention, if my man came up to me and did this just out of the goodness of his heart, just for the, our family, the intention, it makes my heart, my heart flutter. Knowledge and Shamik started scheming on how they was going to find Bundy and knowledge knew where Keisha lived. So he knew Tommy wouldn't be far behind. Oh crap. Okay. So they definitely planning on bro. You know, the truth is like the light and no matter what clouds are true, eventually the sun will come out i feel like that dude that agent trapped him low-key because he knew that he would probably actually start yeah believing in this stuff so he's like you got to kill the minister but then he started believing it along the way because he has to get close to the minister now he he's gonna get to that point where he can get close to him and he doesn't want to do it you know what i'm saying we just here looking for this naked adult tell us where to find his ass uh -uh. what the hell see she ain't do nothing to nobody why are y'all bothering her Serious. Yeah, y'all gotta go. Peace, shorty. You stay cool. Don't hurt nobody. Mm-mm. See, nah. A house with, with your kid in it. Girl, I would have done the same thing. I would have stood my ground like shit. I don't care. Uh-uh. Maybe this nigga gave me up to get out. You no, know? it could be a setup. You could never tell with this nigga. I don't think he set you up. My life's in a whole other direction, dog. So I can see that. You know, I don't believe you, though, right? What is... <laughs> So because he's dressed like that, he knows his life is in another direction. Followers and no purpose and all that shit, all your issues and shit. We all make mistakes, especially me. I'm not buying this. He playing this away. He flipped the switch way too hard. Got that from you. I feel it's the only way. And then those guys are still coming after him. So you guys have to think how you mess your life up in the past. Your past always comes back to bite you in the butt. Always. So now he's talking about he changing his shit. You know what I'm saying? But them dudes are still after him now. What can I say? But no, congratulations. Good luck on your trip to the motherland. Good luck and bonds. The motherland. <laughs> well, I ain't gonna really need none of that. You know what I'm saying? Accept it as a gift. G. One. One. Bro, you not gonna need a car? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Did I miss something? Our people are all in place. Spread the word. 
Wow, he's still gonna go through with it. Real messy, no mistakes. You copy that? Hey man, you have to do it or you don't get your freedom, but you get that freedom, you're gonna be dead anyways. Again, your past came back to bite you in the ass, buddy. Did they touch you? I got scared, so I just pulled out, but they left quietly. They was looking for Tommy, they don't care about him. We just forgot about that Keisha girl. She just, she just dipped, she disappeared, which I'm kind of happy about. Thank God she didn't try to find, stay with that man again. Do what you said, let's just split and just go to Africa. We should just go. Damn. We should just go. I'm so happy that he puts his woman first. It's it, that's that's real beautiful, but me, my wifey, little C, we all out, man. Bro, his tooth is crazy. Long ass flight too. I ain't never coming back. That's what I was thinking about. Never coming back. Talking about he ain't never coming back. They gonna catch up with you, bro. You gonna wanna live this dream out and they gonna catch up with you right before you leave. Well, I broke out for a minute. What up? Yo, what up, man? What's up, baby? Man, no. You got a baby too over here holding it like it's a taco. Y'all better not. Y'all better not hurt that baby. No. Oh my god, no, please, no. Oh my god, I thought they was gonna shoot him, bro. I was about to cry, bro. That the Africa, man. Like for real, that shit was about to hurt. I'm so happy they didn't shoot him. Oh my god, I'm so happy they didn't shoot him. Oh, okay. It's just a leg shot though. That that's okay. They could still they could still fix that up and be okay. I don't give a fuck though. We still gonna go. Ain't nothing stopping us from leaving. I don't give a f no more. And he just wanna go. Yes, look at him. He just wanna be gone. Like I can never be in Times Square for New Year's. That should be hectic. Let that bitch Tommy know what's real up in the battlefield. Get that bitch. Bring that nigga out in the front. And then they gonna get his girl kid. Oh my god, bro. He has done nothing but leave a bunch of, of hell and fire and, and just catastrophe behind him. Just a bunch of chaos behind him. He not only ruined his life, but ruined so many others. Like... You better get this done or you ain't gonna have your freedom, buddy. Oh my God, bro, this is so messed up. Everything is all over the place. What is he waiting on them to move? He's trying to do some sneaky shit. That agent told him to plant the drugs in his office. How did he not see him? You can see his little eyeball peeking out the light. Oh my God, look at this, this blur on his lighting. That's how you know the camera was dookie back then. <laughs> What the heck? Before you pull that trigger, I would like the chance to tell you something to think about after I'm gone. Don't worry about me stalling. Why is he talking like that? Today marks the change of not only a new year, but a new millennium. Take a look around. This minister know what he's talking about. It sounds like he reading literally straight from a script, but he still know what he's talking about. An uncaring, unfeeling generation without knowledge of self. This is the future of our nation. So he actually giving a speech. The evil men of this world have applied every method possible to deceive its occupants. Oh my God, I hate that he's giving this speech while they really about to do that to this girl. This girl is so innocent. She ain't do nothing to nobody. See, I hear too much. I would have heard all that. All the window moving, window opening. I would have heard that. I'm too paranoid. What the hell? Ah! Dang. Ah! Ah! They use what. Ooh, defense like a mother. Look at her. Oh. Punk ass mother. Go. Why you do that to me? I hate you. Have you ever. <gasps> Did she actually shoot him? The dishonor of our most valuable resource, the black woman. Help me to put an end. You think he cares about any of that? I love how they're counting down and showing everything. That is, oh my God. This ending scene is probably my favorite freaking scene. Drop the gun. Hold it, stay where you are. Will you choose life? It's time, man. It's time. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, y'all, I did not see this coming. Oh, that is so sweet. 
And then the other guy can't even kill him because the girl killed him. Everybody together. Me, Tion, Kenya. It's like a whole new beginning. Oh my god, no! <laughs> oh man. Okay, y'all. That's the end of the movie. That made me so overwhelmed. Like, y'all know that the movies like these, a lot of the old classics or hood movies or hood classics, whatever, they never have an happy ending. Usually, most of the time, they don't have a happy ending. This one, this is a different kind of happy ending. Like, uh, South Central, my reaction to South Central, there was a happy ending in that one. It was a happy ending that left me happy, you know? Uh, this one, this happy ending, because it was based so spiritually it really like i don't want to cry right now. <laughs> it was so beautiful and it's like it's like god literally put tommy's path right in front of him like he was like hey these guys are gonna kill you but the girl that they you know went to go she killed them so they can't <laughs> kill you anymore unfortunately you know she has to get her ass beat for it but still worked out the home the other dude got his, he realized it faster he got his life together and left to africa with his family and he is happy uh it, it just it, it was so karma came in the best way to those who deserved it there's good karma too but you know the bad karma came as well whatever you know and, and God really showed him how he was meant to live his life. And that was just, that was so beautiful to me. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to that. I really enjoyed this movie. And if you enjoyed it, do not forget to like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. This has been MJ and don't ask about Spider-Man. Peace. Stop, stop.